Hello, my name is Billy Josephson. I work for LFV, the Swedish Air Navigation Service Provider. And uh, we are involved in various activities. We provide service to air traffic uh, most of the time from towers and from centers. And my background is an air traffic controller and I went into research for some 20 years ago. And uh, the recent years we started dealing with research on automation, how to integrate the automation with the human capabilities. The eye tracking is particularly interesting uh, because we can find out exactly how the controller works and how the controller use his or her capabilities to find out about information and to draw conclusion and to execute actions. And when we learn about that, we can transform that knowledge into design uh, ideas and how to design the equipment and that is how to be more efficient and be more safe in the operations. Eye tracking is very objective. You cannot really uh, fake how you work. Uh, if you don't find something on the screen, if it's too cumbersome, it's very easy to find out that. And then you can follow up to asking questions about what's happening here. And then you can hear the subject saying sometimes I couldn't find a thing because it's not in the way where I expect it to be. Help to explain what you're doing, how you work. And sometimes the operator are basically surprised when they see how they work and how to use their own uh, capabilities and resources. Uh, in, a, in a study we did a year ago with the Tobi equipment actually, we found out that the operator were really not finding information and they were kind of frustrated and then we replay the film for the operator and we found that there was a mode error that confused the operator and that was not easy to find without this eye tracking equipment. Those insights are actually invaluable when you have to change something in your system. You have to redesign the system, you have to do it right because it's very expensive to do changes. We at LFV, we have been working with Tubi now for some over two years uh, and we also work together with Linship in University because we have a collaboration. Uh, Tubi has been very flexible and uh, meeting our requirements and it's also interesting that we we gave feedback on early models and on software which we really didn't appreciate that much and now we see a change which is much appreciated. 